I am really excited about this new luggage. I wanted to show you guys first when I open it. We traveling with MVST Select, new aluminum luggage. Let's check it out. So as you guys know, Tumi is a very popular uh, brand of travel bag, very durable, great uh, reputation. Actually, this handle became a little bit loose um, as I was traveling over the years. And actually, I just sent it in to Tumi and they re uh, replaced the handle, uh, fixed it, and it's been great ever since. And that's the thing with Tumi bags, right? If you have problems, they replace and take care of it, and they are uh, uh, very durable. This one I love, the red and black, uh, it's made it stood out. I always use this as a carry-on, so I never had to check it, but it's been a great bag. However, I wanted to move up to the aluminum zipperless luggage brand. MVST Select was uh, a brand that I came up with, saw a lot of good reviews. Ordered this on sale uh, in July here in the States. But I wanted to first show this to you guys when I open it. This is going to be really exciting. First time I had an aluminum bag. As you know, zippers on bags can be a way that people break into your bag, uh, being insecure, just from the pure design of it. Some are better than others. As you can see with this Tumi bag, this actually has a seal around the zipper um, to prevent or help prevent someone getting into it, but still, with enough force, uh, you can penetrate any bag that just has a zipper. So this is a little bit different design, more secure. This is a check bag, um, so I wanted to move up a little bit higher because I'm not finished with Tumi. Tumi's been great, I'll use that as a carry-on. Wanted to try this one for a check bag. So let's go ahead and open this guy up. Really excited. I think it was pretty good, and we see it's sealed here. Make sure that uh, if something does penetrate the box, it will still be in good shape. All right, let's take this out. It came in this dust cover. You see the box outside was beaten up a little bit uh, in shipping, so I don't know whose fault that was, but the inside of the box uh, is lined. I'll show you that first with uh, a little bit of packaging inside there, so if anything did hit the hit the bag, it was protected. So first of all, well protected uh, box. Now for the exciting part. Let's take a look at our new bag. Take the dust cover off. A decent dust, dust cover. As you can see, I went with the red. Beautiful red color. Really shows up nice on this aluminum. We'll put the dust cover over there. Nice. First impression, you see the solid hinges there. Really heavy, sturdy design. I don't say really heavy, but a heavy design. Of course, it's aluminum, so it's gonna be uh, a little bit heavier uh, than the other materials. You can see there are two locks. And then you can see no zippers around the edges, right? So this is a full metal case that closes and secures uh, very nicely. See the hinges there on the back. All right, so let's get into uh, opening this guy up uh, and then see what it looks like on the inside. All right, because as you can see, all the handles shipped with this uh, plastic uh, cover on it and a coating um, to prevent the handles from getting scratched up or damaged. So that was pretty nice. Uh, let's go ahead and get those off. All right, so we got the plastic off the handles. I uh, left the plastic on this shipping handle. Uh, uh, just didn't feel like fooling with it. But I wanted to show you just first, and this is the first time I've actually opened this bag. Um, got it sitting up, and you can see here the TSA locks. And the TSA locks look like they're, it's a hard plastic. Everything else is metal. And these are actually buttoned at the bottom, fold open, flip down, and then the case opens. Very nice on the inside, as you can see. Uh, this is a partition. Again, I told you the first time I've opened it, so you just push up on this latch. And you've got this partition here. Good material, good, good uh, to the touch. You can tell it's uh, very high quality uh, all the way around. Let's clip this back on.
And then you have this other side here, and I'll turn it around. Really a solid, sturdy material, but not, you know, not crazy heavy, but it's definitely, uh, you can feel the sturdiness of it. We can see uh, this is this is what you expect in this quality of a bag. You can see the uh, this is a metal um, attachment here, a latch for your uh, your garment side and your divider. This can zip out if you don't like this, uh, and take this right out if you don't like too many dividers. I do like the dividers because when you open your bag, things don't spill out. Keeps the things uh, really neat. Uh, I'll also use this if you have dirty clothes, separate from clean clothes if you're traveling, if you don't have a, a laundry service where you are, which is always nice because it's great to take back uh, clean clothes, so doing laundry while you're on travel. Now this is a protective bag. Now this has actually changed. I know I saw some uh, videos and reviews where this was a, a more of a dust bag. So they've changed this to be a plastic bag, which is nice for, uh, for uh, rainy weather if you're traveling. Um, as well as when you check the bag, uh, if you're flying, uh, prevent scratches from happening on your, your aluminum bag, which is bound to happen, but this can help, uh, help minimize that. So this is pretty cool. I will be using this uh, when I check the bag. As you know, the baggage throwers have a tendency to be pretty rough on luggage. So this is a way to help preserve uh, the investment you made in the aluminum luggage. Um, but that's pretty much it. I love the solid design. I love the, the individual um, par, uh, pockets, even within the partition. You have, uh, whoops, put this up so you can see it. You can see the uh, individual pockets here uh, on both sides. And then what do we have here? Probably instructions and documentation. You have an MVST. Uh, a little box with the instructions and some details in there. So we'll take a look at that later. But that's pretty much it, guys. I am actually very excited. Love this, uh, the way this luggage look. Looking forward to see how it travels, uh, how much it can hold. Uh, but uh, so far, great first impression. Uh, again, it was shipped really well. Uh, it's a very solid case. And I'll show you just kind of closing that with no zippers. Clamps right down and then one thing I didn't do, let's test the wheels, how smooth the wheel system is. And how high that, sometimes as a tall guy, I'm 6'2", with the handle, seems like it's the right height, right? Not too short of a handle, not too high. And uh, very smooth with the wheels, the system, so this will really glide nicely uh, throughout the airport. But again, if you look at my Tumi, I like the red theme, as you can tell. Tumi carry-on versus my MVST Select. And this is not too bad. It's like you can almost sneak this on as a carry-on, but it is officially um, a check luggage bag. But I love the way the look of it, not too big. Uh, again, I will do another review on the next trip, carrying my new bag. Thanks guys for tuning in. Hit that like button and subscribe if you found this valuable or even entertaining. Have a good one. See you on your next trip. Bye-bye.